Hello, this is Paul, and I'm going to show something real quick. Uh, how to make like a spread out little pattern of holes for like a watering can, and the fastest way I can think of doing it. So first things first, you will need to have user preps, and you will want loop tools. So make sure you have this enabled. It should be in the included setup plugin, so just enable loop tools. Because you will need that for doing this quickly. So I got the cube here, but we don't need that right now. What we want is a cylinder. So I'm going to click over here, create a cylinder, and something with an even number of vertices, or the perimeter is 32. Usually it works with an even number. I'm just going to bump it up a little, 36. You can pick a different number. It's fine. And I'm going to go to edit mode. And I'm going to select this end face end gun and hit Alt P. Which turns it into Pi. So, and then to get from the Pi, I just want to select these edges that radial out. There's two ways I think you can do that. You can select that vertex and then hold down control and change the selection. Or you can use the circle select tool, hit C, and just click on it that way. And either way will work. And I go with the W menu to get subdivide, and I subdivide it really quick like that. And just be aware if you go too tight with these, it can cluster up in the middle. So. So, you know, and I'm going to select these rings here by holding down Alt and Shift to get the others. So, those rings there. And after that, I go to the Select menu and go Checker Deselect. Oops. Actually, I wanted to do is select these again. <laughs> go to Vertex mode first. And then Checker Deselect. Alright. So now I have alternating patterns of them selected and deselected. I hit Control B bevel. And right now you notice it's being weird not doing anything because you have to, if you look at the little menu below it, you'll see that V is vertex only and that's what you want. So you hit V for vertex. And now it does this pattern. And once you get these a suitable size, what you want to do is scroll your wheel up a notch or two. Like so. And now you have these clusters of little patterns here, which define where your holes are. So now the quickest way to get holes is go to Loop Tools and hit Circle, and it makes them into little circles. And one more thing I think might be a good idea to do is uh, inset. Or maybe hit the outset option of inset. And you just want these little perimeter rings because that will control your smoothing and then you can extrude these in. And the rest just pretty much involves drawing edges around to make sure this is all quads and stuff like that. So oh, I just like this loop. <laughs> you know, and then uh inner region or something. Select inner region. That can work too. And then, uh, just make sure there's like loops around. But anytime you have a surface that folds like this edge here, or the edges on those holes, you want another loop of edges to go around it. So when you smooth it, it won't look so bad. But uh, draw that up with quads. Let's set the shading to smooth. And I'll add a uh, subdiv modifier. And you can see the holes retain pretty well. There's some weird stuff there, but that's because I didn't fix the end guns. So if I turn on wireframes, you can see it's a bit of a mess. So what you gotta do is make sure it's all quads. Can be a wall. Can I do that? Can I do that quick? I don't know if the selection tools are that robust, but we shall see. Let's see if we can fix that a little bit. 
So I'm going to select one of these weird faces and similar polygon sides. Sandals. Okay, and I'm going to do Control T for triangulate and Alt J for quadrangulate. It's still a mess to try, so it's not quite quick. I think it's just you're going to have to fix it manually, but <laughs> I tried. Yeah, it's just going to have to be done, and you're just going to have to draw edges around manually to fill it in and. And here where it's tight, you just gotta be careful. But once you fix that and get the edge flow good, you won't have that weird stuff going on. But it'll get you your holes, and you just go around with the knife tool and go crazy. But the fast part is done. Alright.